Do you think I would have invited you if us we were not alone? For a moment, whether or not I find you did not matter, you could go. But the feeling of abandon, as if I were being fucked by an angel, without penetration, but penetrated to the core was brief. As the gangsters say, it's nothing personal. Naturally, I had never seen you before. You never did anything to harm me personally. You never raped me. You never raped anyone I know. It's even possible that you never raped anyone at all. It's not something personal. Personally or impersonally, you and I will enter my house again, and get undressed, and I will feel your hands again clumsily stroking my back, my ass, my crotch, looking for my clitoris perhaps, but not knowing exactly where it is, I will undress you again, and take your cock in both hands and say, you're so big, when, in fact, you're not so big. You were the lost prince who gave me an orgasm. You can be proud of yourself, and I gave you an opportunity to escape, but you were also the death prince. Now it's too late. Women are bitches killers. They are monkeys stiff with cold watching the horizon from a sick tree. They are princesses searching for you in the darkness, crying, examining the words that they will never be able to say. In me third or standing we live and plan the cycles of our life. No one will ever understand my words of love. Do you remember anything I said while you were screwing me? Now it's too late. You'll have to make the best of it. Now is nor the time to look inside yourself. And try to understand that sometimes, unexpectedly, People just walk away, close your eyes, there's no need to go on looking, think of something nice, think of it as hard as you can, you can, I am sure, you can, tell me, you can? I can.